Hello guys, welcome back to Good Fraud Tips. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to fix server disconnection issue on Black Ops 4. Right? So it is quite disgusting when you're having server disconnections in a game. So I'm not wasting much time. Let me directly get into the steps. So first thing, what you have to do is when you're having these kind of issues, what you have to do is you just have to restart your PC and power cycle the router. So make sure to restart your computer first. If nothing happens, you should also try to power cycle the Wi-Fi router to do this. Turn off your router and just unplug from the Ethernet cable and power cable from the power source. And just wait for at least few seconds of time and most probably this can fix the issue up. Also, I would like to make you add a few things that just make sure all the time the internet connection is good enough when you're trying to play any game, not this one, but anything. And also just try out to restart when you're having some kind of server issues. This is just a common method that you can try out. So moving on to the next one, what you have to do is you just have to update the networking drivers. This is quite interesting and it's quite important to update the drivers. So I suggest not only updating the drivers, but also you can go for you know you can go for things like you know what i have to say is you know you can go for the windows update as well as even the graphics card update you can check from here itself windows update from the start menu where you have to type like this and just have to go for it then from here you just have to check for any kind of update sorry this is not the way you just have to search for windows not update when you have to search for windows update where you just have to go for check for updates and then you just have to you know check yourself in if any kind of updates are available if updates are available just go for the updates because you know it can fix the issue up in most of the cases right so this is quite interesting very happy where this can fix the issue up so uh, you can update yourself when you're having the updates right so as you can see that you're up to date so there is no updates available but if you are having the updates just go for it then what I wanted to make you notice in the same way just keep in mind yourself that the graphic drivers are up to date as you can see that I think there is an update is available 2.9.1 I just have to download it but at the time we are just recording I'm not going to go for that but when you're having the update just go for it right that's can fix the issue up right so that's what second it's all about and then if you're moving on to the next one is all about change the DNS servers right so we you have to change the DNS server which can fix the issue up so now what you have to do is to change the DNS server you just have to go here in the start menu then you have to go for settings you just have to go for settings you have to select this then from here you have to go for network and then you have to select this then from here you have to go for network and sharing just have to select network and sharing you have to go for that so you just have to uh, select on network and sharing center then you have to go for change adapter settings over here there is change adapter setting right click on that then you just have to you know you just have to select yourself or actual connector interconnect now you have to select where you are connected so i'm connected to oh the wi-fi so i just have to you know just have to go to the properties then i just have to change from here i just have to under the networking tab as you can see that on now i have to double click on the internet protocol version 4 so now i have to search here as you can see the internet for the 4 as you can see this brings me this and now from here i have to give the respective server address like i have to give for input i have to give the respective address so in the same way i have to give the respective address here so what i'm trying to do is you have to give the input as you know one 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 which is actually correct and you know the preferred dns server as one zero zero one which is actually done and now you have to do that and it's most probably this is to get changed but here i just made already the fix because i'm having the issue so i have already done that and once after that you just have to go for okay then you just have to get back and try to play the game once again and whether you have to try yourself whether it's going to work or not next one the fourth one which i just wanted to make you notice is use a vpn service there are tons of vpn service actually and one of my favorite is turbo vpn you can use that up so sometimes you know that can fix the issue up so it is available right now if you search for it from uh, the google just search for turbo 
vpn yourself and you can get it from there that you can get oh you know a lot of thing over here on the turbo vpn where you get a lot of features you can install itself and it's one of the best in my opinion because i was using this on for a lot of time and i don't have any kind of issues so this is what it's all about when it comes to how to fix the server disconnector issue on black ops 4 so if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notifications if you have any doubts do ask in the comment section where we and our team will get back to you this is shahin signing off in the church keep practice social distance be safe and stay safe